and welcome to my YouTube channel today. How have you been, guys? How has it been? Has the whole process been? Yeah, I've been quite busy with New School as we just finished the launch, and New School is still up for sixty thousand there today. 5,999 love for signing up for NIM school. It's been an amazing section. NIM school, it's a virtual school where you could learn profitable online marketing skills. And one of the products, on all the, the, the courses we just released at NIM school was the e commerce course, which is what I basically talk about most in this channel. And in that e commerce course, can make you a whole lot of millions, millions of naira. And one of the products we dumped at uh, the, the talk we'll talk about. And, this school can make you about 10 between 5 million. Uh, imagine, I'll talk about like 10 of that kind of product. So you can just easily go to pick one and start working on it. So it's super, super amazing. It's been an amazing launch and we're super grateful to God for the whole thing. So if you don't follow me on social media, you should please follow me on my handles that you'll be seeing on the screen. So, and again, if you follow through this video till the end, I will show you how to run profitable Facebook advert that convert in 2022. You know, it's not just running any kind of other, it's only that one that converts. That one that converts, I'll show you the element, what to do, what not to do, the kind of advert you should run. The one that will convert for you in this new year. Alright, so let's go. So times have changed. Yeah, times have really, really changed. The Facebook advert platform has also evolved. So times has changed, the Facebook advert platform has also evolved. A whole lot of things are now on the Facebook other platform, the interface has changed, the whole um, user interface, the even billing, sometimes I even removing some things from targeting, and removing some stuff from digital targeting, everything like the whole thing has changed. It's not like it used to be before. It has like it's a whole new environment now. Even the way it was some two years ago, even last year, like the campaign, the ad sets, the ad section, the way it was is not the way it is now. Like a lot of things have changed in the Facebook other platform and of course so um and when things change you as a individual growing or becoming a better person you should change your things here yeah, you should not be stagnant okay so once things are changing especially in an industry that makes you money what you should do too is to change with things okay so if you watch this to the end i will show you how to, to learn how to run multiple eight figures for other and not just that you would also learn how to how to uh, 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 run others for, for people for profit? Yes. So not just for your product. So you also learn to run for others for people for profit. Can you set up an advert agency? Okay. So before you run a Facebook advert, first thing to do is to get get a Facebook account with activity. Now, like I said, times have changed. Some two three years ago, if you want to run a Facebook advert, just get an account and run. Can you create an account now, 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 now? And you run the Facebook advert immediately. Okay, but right now things have really, really changed. Things have really, really changed, right? So because things have changed, the first thing to do is to get the Facebook account with activity. Okay, with activity I mean the first thing is chatting with the accounts, uploading pictures. Second one is get a Facebook account with pictures in them. Okay, yeah, with pictures in them because they want to. They must always ask you for ID. If you get an account, they will check you out and ask you for ID to verify it. So because they ask for ID, they can't verify an account for with, with ID when there's no picture in the account. So you have to get these pictures into the account. So you have to get an account, get an ID for the account. All right, so you have to get an ID for the account. So that the person send me your national ID card, your driving license, your 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 what's it called, your any valid ID card, your international passport, so as to verify it. Because Facebook will ask you to verify every account that you need to run ads. It is not like it used to be before. Don't always forget. It's not like it used to be before. Times have changed. Seasons have changed. Maybe management have changed too. That's why the whole thing is crazy. So then the fourth thing to do is to get a Facebook account ready. Is to get a Facebook account ready. When you do that, get a Facebook account ready. So you get an account with activity. Don't just go and carry a redundant account. Don't just go and carry a redundant account. An account that has no activity in it. Don't just go and carry that. A user account. Don't do that, please. Don't carry a redundant account. You would not. That account would not benefit you. That account will not benefit you okay so get an account with pictures in them they must have pictures it's a must this account must have pictures because we'll be asked to validate it okay then get an account with an get the id for the account now the one thing we'll do is if the person doesn't have an id 
you have to get someone to do an ID for you. Yeah, and it's very very it's quite easy, it's not difficult. You pay someone one five and they will do an ID for you. Okay, so different types of adverts account, Facebook advert. The first one is what we call the publicity advert, alright? Or what we call the awareness advert. This is what you use for to run church crusades, to run political campaigns, that the kind of adverts you use to do these kind of things. So it's called the awareness advert. The awareness and I'll never forget it. The awareness about the publicity advert. You see on the Facebook advert interface too. Now the second one is page like advert. The third one is sales, also got conversion advert. Then there's leads. Leads are contact details of people. Okay? Contact details of people like their email address, their phone number, their name, their leads, their contact details, what you could use to contact them. We have the leads advert, okay. We have the video views advert. These are advert used to run advert for YouTube videos and stuff like that from Facebook, yes. So we have the video views advert, okay. Then we have the WhatsApp messages advert. The advert that you run and they send you a message directly on WhatsApp. If you sell things online, sell things on your WhatsApp status, so you have to have, you, you can run this type of advert to generate contact. So tell people please save my number so you can see my status. So my status you actually can what increase. Okay, so the sales advert is the advert you run in e-commerce, the one that gets you the orders, the one that may put order from you. Hello, I want to buy this, I want to buy that. It's called the sales advert, or also called the conversion advert. Okay, I don't know why it's showing the way it's showing, but what you run advert from is um, www.facebook.com forward slash ads manager in your Facebook advert in 2022. These are the 10 things you must get right. You must run profitable and converting to advert in 2022. So you must get these 10 things right. Okay. So the first thing you must get right is your audience age range. Yes, your audience age range. You don't have to sell something that for old people to young people. Okay. So if you must show your Facebook advert, get your audience age range the top notch. Okay, so your audience age will not be top one. It must be something that you know, and it comes from research and questions. Who are the people that need this product? You're selling a beauty product. Who are the people that need to look beautiful? Of course, women. Now, what age of women can invest in beauty? Because for women, beauty is an investment. It's not vain for them. Beauty is not vain for a woman, no. Let me explain. <laughs> Let me explain something to you. Beauty is not vain for a woman. It's an investment. <laughs> Oh my god. A woman, if she's beautiful, she will get more jobs, she will get more offers, she will get more favors. So if I tell you that if you do this thing, you get more favors, you get more jobs, you get more offers. And of course, um like naturally, if that if that equation is followed, she will get more money. But I tell you that this will make you more money. Won't you will you term it as vain or will you tempt it as an, as an investment? You will tempt it as an investment. So when women do this, thing, don't think it's vain no. All the BBL, Brazilian butt lifts, um, um, boob lifts, hip surgery, no surgery. It's not vain for them. It's investment. Yes, the people that sit at the front desk of of of, of multinationals as clerks and secretaries. Have you seen an uh, have you seen an ugly girl there before? Air hostesses. Have you seen any air hostess that's ugly? I must say, everybody's ugly. Of course, beauty is in the eyes of the beholder, and it depends on what you're beholding, or who you're beholding, or who's beholding you. Okay, but I'm saying that the people you see, that women you see that are on the top, 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 top of quality jobs, except those that we know that their brain got them, those are very few. Sorry, I must say women are not brainy. So please don't quote me. I love that gender and I advocate for them a lot. So please don't say, don't misquote me or don't misattack me. Don't put, pick up this video and send it to blogs. Please don't do that. What I'm actually saying, and you understand what I'm saying, I know you understand what I'm saying. What I'm actually saying is that those that call this in quotes beautiful job, they are face cards. Like their face card game is top notch. They are beautiful. We know it. So for a woman, beauty is not vain. Beauty is an investment. Let's not enter that place. Okay. So the end what age what age of women need to look beautiful? We can see from 25 to 40, from 25 to 38, those kind of whenever it crosses 40, 45, beauty is not a problem again. She can just keep dancing, yes, we can keep glowing. So these people can invest in beauty. So you don't want to start targeting for 45 to 65 or 45 to 65 plus for beauty. That's a wrong age. A very, very wrong age. You have a product that sells for 30,000, you're targeting for 18 years to 25 years. People that are still in school are looking for one to buy handouts. 
So you have to get your age range right. Your age range must be right. It must be right, 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 right. Okay. The other one is your audience, audience interest. What is your, what is your audience interested in? You must get it right. People that let's go back to example beauty products. People that buy beauty products, they are interested in number one beauty magazines, number two beauty palaces, beauty places, number three beauty, beauty salons, number four beauty brands. This Kelajana brands, what's her name? This uh, Kelajana uh, is her name now. Z Zara. Which other makeup brands? I have to know them because I have to target beauty products very well. Evo, what are you? All makeup, so they're taking the makeup brand. So you have to know your audience interests. Your audience interests. What are they interested in? This now tell you make for an effective Facebook advert. Third one is your audience location. Where are they located? You cannot be targeting Bonu or your audience is in Lagos and Abuja. You are targeting Jigawa, Dusi, Lafia. When your audience is in Asaba, Benin, Imo State, Are you seeing that now? And you're targeting any boost where your audience is in Nasarawa. So you must know where your audience are. If your audience are, if you want to cover the whole Nigeria, okay, you target the whole Nigeria. If you want to cover Lagos, Abuja, and Portacos, you target Lagos, Abuja, and Portacos. Alright, let's go. Audience device. You have to know the devices your audience use. Do there is an iPhone? Do there is an Android phone? Do there is both iPhone and Android phone? Do there access from, do there, do there access Facebook through a desktop? You don't access Facebook to a, a phone. And let me give you a quick example. Nobody has access Facebook to a desktop nowadays. It's only old people in the office. Because okay, so everybody has access Facebook to phones. Whether it's Android or, or Apple or, or, or Apple. So you have to know these things. And know the kind of device they use and how to target them. Android version, what version. Now you may want to place it by leaving your advert on what's called all device. All device. All device. Okay. Excluding desktop. The by of my main computer. Number five, the right budget. If you use the wrong budget, Facebook will blow your money. Facebook will blow your money if you use the wrong budget. So what you need to do is to use the right budget. Five thousand naira, ten thousand naira, twenty, twenty-five, thirty thousand, forty, fifty. You will start with instead of average about hundred thousand naira, Facebook will blow your money. So you have to get it right in budget. Number six, compelling creative. Your creative must be very, very compelling. Your creative must be very, very compelling. The video and image are amazing. It must be very, 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 very compelling. So your creative must be very, very compelling. By creative, I mean the section of your advert that people see. You want to get a good video, you want to get a good image, you want to get something quality. Let's go. Compelling headline. I have told you before, if you watch the sales funnel video we did last week, it's the headline is not making people to comment on your advert. They have to post and comment. If your hairline is weak, your advert will be definitely very, very weak. So you have to get a compelling headline to make your advert work. The right button, the right button. Don't go use lemon when you have to. You have to use shop now. Don't go use. Go to WhatsApp when you have to use add to cart. You understand? So get the right button for your advert. The right placement. Know where to place your advert. Where are your audience? You can't be sent to old people targeting Instagram. They are not there. They are not there. They are not on Instagram. They are on Facebook news feed, Facebook groups. Yeah, your audience sometimes can be on Facebook stories. They can be on apps, web banners. So you have to know where how to place your advert. Okay. The last one is the right scaling system. Some of the scaling system that works on Facebook is you have to duplicate the campaign and increase the budget. Some of them is you have to duplicate the ad. Listen, listen, like you just duplicate the ad. The ad, not the campaign, not the ad, the ad. You won't convert into duplicate by four or by three. All right, then leave the budget like that. Leave the 